Today's network is complex, and now with DX NetOps Manager, you can monitor all your fault, performance, and flow data all together in NetOps Portal. The first step towards setting this monitoring environment begins with the installation of DX Performance Center along with NetOps Portal. Go ahead and watch this demo to learn the installation process. To begin, browse to the Download Management Portal and search for Performance Management. You will see the list of software according to your license terms and conditions. Download the Performance Management Multi-Platform Installer. Once downloaded, run the setup file. The installation begins. The wizard prompts you to select the language. Let's move ahead with English by entering 1. Next, to accept the end user license agreement, Press Enter. Continue pressing Enter to read carefully and scroll through all terms and conditions. When the wizard prompts for acceptance, press Y to accept the terms. Next, the wizard provides information about the memory required for installation. Press Enter to continue. The wizard now prompts to choose the installation type. Press Enter to move ahead with the default option. Now you need to specify the destination of the installation folder. Once again, press Enter to proceed with the default. You will be prompted to specify the memory allocation for Performance Center services. Press Enter to proceed with the default. Similarly, press Enter to proceed with the default configuration for Application Performance Management. Next, the wizard prompts you to enter the location for MySQL data directory. Press Enter to proceed with the default location. The installation begins. Wait until it completes. A message confirms successful installation. Now, exit the installer. This completes the installation process for DX Performance Center along with NetOps Portal. After this, you need to add the data sources to view the fault, performance, and flow data within the NetOps Portal. To learn about the installation of individual data sources and data repository, refer to the videos available in the Tech Docs. Navigate to the Administration tab, Data Sources menu, and click Data Sources. Here, you need to add the data sources which would fetch the data from the monitoring tools and display in NetOps Portal. Click Add. Here, you need to provide the data source details. For example, select the source type, host name, port, and display name details. Ensure the status field is Enabled, and then click Test. A message displays the test result. Once the test result is successful, click Save. Wait until the data source gets synchronized. Similarly, add other data sources. For example, to monitor the flow, you need to add data source of network flow analysis. In this way, add all the data sources which would enable you to fetch monitoring data from all data sources. Thank you for watching this video. For more detailed information about this product, click the information bubble in the top right corner to load the product page. From there you can visit product documentation, support, communities, or see the learning paths.